folks. Remember there's two kinds of waves, mechanical and electromagnetic. One example of mechanical waves is transverse waves, and one example of transverse waves are water waves. Now, here I've got a whole container, a whole tub of water. And that's what we're seeing right here. Okay, let's go ahead and stop this right now. Let's go. All right, so I'm gonna bob this yellow tennis ball up and down inside the tub of water so that you can actually see how transverse waves are produced. Remember, transverse waves are waves vibrating at right angles, 90 degrees, to the direction of propagation. I'm gonna show you that right now using this tennis ball and this tub of water. Let's check it out. Observe that little droplet of water as it travels from the bottom of the tennis ball to our container of water. That droplet creates a wave, some transverse waves of water. And you can see that wave propagating throughout the entire container as the circle's radius gets bigger and bigger and bigger, but its intensity decreases with respect to the radius. Now you can watch the side view as this water droplet drops into the water and produces a transverse wave. And that's all you need to know about transverse water waves. In the next episode, we're going to check out more about different types of water waves.